Real women murders, not fiction. Love women, don't kill them. Giving real women, unknown women, recognition to the world. Please support our channel and please, please subscribe. Field is shot and killed by police. Investigators say he was on the run after killing his ex-girlfriend and shooting her boyfriend. Fox 2's Jessica Dupnak joining us live. And Jessica, how the suspect and the kid victim had kids together. Do we know if they're okay at this point? Those kids are okay. They are currently with family and the suspect actually dropped those kids off here in the area of Seven Mile and the Lodge at a friend's house. Before this all happened with police, he gave those children some money and said his goodbyes. The scene behind me clearing up right now, but this is where it all ended for that 49 year old man allegedly pulling an assault rifle out towards police and they fired at him. He fell out the car and just died. But uh, it's very traumatizing to see. It's, it's very devastating to see. This witness says it perfectly. The day started six miles north of here at the Southfield Marriott after nine o'clock. Evidence markers trail a spray of gunfire where a 49 year old man used an assault rifle and shot his child's mother and her new boyfriend. She was killed. He is in critical condition. It appears that he waited in the parking lot until they exited the hotel, at which time he used an assault rifle and did shoot both of them. Police sources say after the double shooting, the 49 year old suspect went to his Warren home, switched out cars into this now shot up black Camaro. He then picked up the couple's kids from school, gave them money and said his goodbyes before dropping them off at a friend's house near the lodge in Seven Mile. Nearby is ultimately where Southfield police tracked him, trying to pull him over. He lower the top of the uh, Camaro uh, just prior to us making that traffic stop, at which time our officers tried to engage him. He did reach for that assault rifle uh, and our officers did use deadly force and uh, shot the suspect, fatally wounded him. Three Southfield police officers were involved in the shooting. The motive here, a jealous ex-partner. There's no excuse for an individual to use this type of violence uh, over breakup. The new boyfriend, the 41 year old man that was shot, he is in critical condition, but we are learning that he is stable. Uh, Southfield Police Chief crediting that man for before he went in the hospital, he gave them some very important information about the suspect, and that was how they were able to track him to this location here. Reporting live on Detroit's West Side, Jessica Dupnak, Fox 2 News. Well, it's good they stopped him when they did. But Jessica, talk about the suspect and his ex's relationship a little bit more. Had there been domestic issues in the past? Had he made threats against her? So on record, according to court records, there were no domestic filings against this man. He did serve some time in prison for an armed robbery in the mid 90s. It does appear that the couple has a long history. Uh, the man is actually from this general area right here. They have a long history, kids together. Mm. Uh, but again, it sounds like jealousy is the motive here. All right, Jessica, thanks. Goodness.
Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.